it was our goal to be uh, to have five companies by December 2014, and we currently have 14 businesses in here. So it's been quite a growth spurt, and it was a little bit unexpected, but we're very, very happy that we've been able to solve this this obvious need in the communities. Quality of life that Chico offers to to entrepreneurs uh, is very unique. The biggest thing I've seen about Chico, the willingness of the populace to give help. It's, it's collaboration and being around other people. I'm a pretty social person. Um, and I've definitely, maybe, maybe to the point that I've taken advantage of people, befriended them and been interested in what they're doing and then try to make it easy on them to help me. <laughs> so if you're a brand new person and you've never run a company before, or you've maybe done one or two and made mistakes, to have resources like that that you can access um, so that you can continue to refine what you're doing. I think that, that, that this is a, just a perfect environment. But ultimately, the biggest benefit that I've noticed since I've been in this position for the last six months is the camaraderie and the collaboration that's happened between like-minded like individuals who are in that entrepreneurial space. Folks that have been successful in startups are coming through here telling you how they've done it. Um, I don't think it gets any better than that. I'm really excited as, as part of this community effort to be a part of the pipeline for workforce development and career development. Why not get onto a, a board where you can come in and advise and, and help these companies grow into, again, like I said, you know, another, a new company that's you know, got a high um, number of employees here in Chico and, and brings that outside revenue to Chico. Some of these other cities have already started some incubator type programs and so by partnering with them we'll be able to strengthen the region as a whole in the entrepreneurial space. So we're really looking forward to doing that in 2015.